We're going to compare the fractions 2 fifths and 4 fifths and figure out which one is bigger. Look at these two fractions. What is the same about them? The denominator is the same. They have like denominators. What's different is the numerator. So we want to make sure we understand what that means before we compare. Every time I'm dealing with fractions, I like to think about having a whole, like a cake or something like that. And that whole cake is going to get split up. The denominator is how many people I'm sharing with. So if I have a piece of cake and there's five of us, I have to split it into five pieces. And since the denominator is the same on two fifths and four fifths, the cake ends up getting split up the same way. So you can see the pieces are the same size here. So these pieces here are all the same size as over here. So the size of the pieces is going to be the same no matter what. And that's what the denominator means. It's how many pieces it has been split into. So since the denominator is the same, we're going to look at the numerator. And the numerator is how many pieces you actually get. So would you rather have two pieces or four pieces? Knowing that the cake got split into fifths either way, so the cake is going to be split the same way, meaning the pieces are the same size no matter what. Would you rather have two of those pieces or four of those pieces? So the numerator refers to how many pieces you're actually talking about. The denominator helps us see how the cake got split up, so it helps influence the size of those actual pieces. So in this case, four pieces would be bigger than two pieces since the size will be the same no matter what. When you are writing your less than, greater than symbols, so this one is greater than, that one is less than, I like to think about it as if it were an alligator with teeth or a Pac-Man. And that Pac-Man is going to eat the bigger fraction because it's hungry. So we're going to draw it with its mouth opening towards 4 fifths because that is the bigger fraction.